Hello guys, welcome back to Let's Be Play Spyro of the Dragon. Last time I accidentally went into Spooky Swamp and I accidentally picked up two gems. <laughs> well, a two gem. So I will show you where I found the two gem. Basically, I did that and there was a two gem like directly behind me. So that's where the two gem was. <laughs> But what, well, what I just did then was accidentally destroy a sign that said piranhas. And we have to destroy all the signs to get a skill point. Also, we can't touch the water because there are piranhas. Big problem. <laughs> that gator was mean. I thought I was a gunner. Thanks for saving me. No problem, Homer. The firefly. So what we have to do is light up all these lanterns. Very pretty. I what I'm noticing is what, as um, time goes on, these Rhinox are acting a lot quicker. And, uh... Oh, what are you doing? The Rhinox are acting quicker, I think. It's kind of cool. It's a bit more challenging. Oh, I hate I hate Rhinox with what? I just I just went right into you. I hate Rhinox with projectiles. Very annoying. If we destroy all the piranha signs, we do get a skill point. If I didn't already say that, which I, think I did. I love this camera angle for some reason. Oh, I just jumped right over you. That's stupid. Oh, camera! Well, I don't know where the guy went. Oh, he's there. Come on then. That was a fail, but I also got him, so that was alright. Very, very, very generous with the coinage down here. The coinage, the gemage, the gemage. So lovely and satisfying when it's like. I love the noise. I actually adore the noise of the gems being picked up by Spark. Little lobsters are our life force in this level as well, so that's a very strange thing. Very weird level, but I really like this one. It's very quirky. Very cool. There's also some really good in-world wielding going on. Actually, there's one that's alright. They're not too bad with Sheila. Sheila, the uh, kangaroo which I quite enjoy. But it's a bit of a cop-out because there's two eggs in there and it's basically they're doing the same thing twice. But um, it's fun and there's like a boss battle as well, kind of. It's fun! It's just fun. Oh, that was boss. Two at once, guys. Two at once. And we have, we need to find the, uh, the key for this chest here. And uh, we have a difficult to find egg over there, so. So you didn't even have to press the triangle button to get to it. Hello, Michael! That would be good if you did the moonwalk. That would have been cool. I looked it up! I looked it up! There's 150 eggs. <laughs> There's 150 eggs in this game and we have 61. So we're not doing too bad. We're not halfway, but we're not nowhere, so... Of course we're not halfway, we're not even halfway through the world yet, so... We're doing really good, though. I did. A, I was practicing the second world as well, the third world even. The um, evening light. That is hard. That place is difficult. <laughs> I was massively failing at um, evening light. And you can see up in the tree. Oh no! Don't go in the water, spark. Fire. Up there in the tree, there's an egg. So we can get that in a bit. Another problem with this this level is that money bags is back. Moneybags has come back to take our gems. <laughs> the horrible swine. I'm not doing very good. Come on. Iggy. Yay! So yeah, I just invested in a PlayStation Portable. It's, a, it's the, be the base one, the, one, the very first one that came out. It cost me £50 with a game. I got um, Ratchet and Clank, Size Matters. And I also got Patapon as well. So I've heard Patapon's really good. So um, I'm quite excited to get it, but I don't have a memory card yet, so I can't really get into everything. So I've ordered a memory card. It should be coming soon, and then I can tell you what I really think about the PlayStation Portable. I was quite excited by it. I was really excited. I was like, Ah! I have a PlayStation Portable. I want to go home and play it. Hello, money bags. This door is jammed shut. Only the power of gems can hope to move it. Is that right?
You've made a wise choice. It will mean more eggs for you and more gems for me. Best of all, Spyro, I can stop speaking haiku. What a sweet relief. Is that what you were doing? I thought you sounded a bit warm. <laughs> That's really random. I've never noticed you started talking about haikus. <laughs> Carry on. But the last lamp is over there. Is it four? I think it's four. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Quick! Oh ho! Yeah, the, they don't necessarily get you, the piranhas, but they will gather around you. And if you stay in there long enough, they will get you. And sometimes they will get you as soon as your bum touches the water. They will get you. They are freaky. Where are you? What's he shooting at me? It looks like it's smoking. Oh, I might get that lobster. Hey. And we have another piranha sign in here, and I just want to get them all. Yay! When all lamps are lit, there is a secret in here that I will show you. I see. So that's the uh, lamp lighting reward. And that is Sheila's level. It's pretty cool. But we're going to go lamp the lights. Lamp. You know what I mean? You are brave, Drake. Much braver than I by far. Here, take this darn egg. Um, oh. Is everyone speaking in haiku? Because I can't remember what haiku actually means. Is everyone speaking in it and that's why all the text is centered? I'm gonna have to look up what haiku is. And there's the door to the other in-world world. Is there only two in this one? I think there's only two. I did a really bad jump in. Oh yeah, it's okay. It's okay. And we want to do is glide from tree to tree. And look, all there's gems on top of it. Oh, there's the key! Yay! Well, you don't pick that up, do you, Sparks? Oh, it's shiny. Oh, but it's... I pressed the fucking jump button! What are you doing?! Okay, we're back here again. Let's try this again. <gasps> so that was better this time, the X button responded. Oh, 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 yay! Hello, Frank. Cool. Bouncy, bouncy dragon. Whoa! Right, we've done that. We've done that. We've been there and got the t-shirt. So let's go, um... I want to do the boss battle. Oh, what are you doing that for? We just stupid not working X button. Right, I might do this boss battle first. Okay. The tea lamps are lit. Now I'll tell you the secret of what's in this house. A creepy wizard lives inside but hits the light. He has awoken. He swore to destroy whoever lights the tea lamps. Better you than me. Okay, let's go fight the wizard. Hello, Sleepy. This is actually quite a foreshadowing to the boss battle that's gonna come at the end of Midday Gardens. It's very similar in style to this. Except for the green attacky things that look like they're from Despicable Me. I'm very bad at aiming these, I will say that now. I tend to just stand and run around in circles and hope for the best. Oh, that hit him! What are you talking about? Oh, he's so sleepy! What a sleepy Rhinoc. Would you please? Yay! Right, we only got to get him once, I think. <laughs> I don't know why there are any gems in this place either. I'm pretty sure there are. I'm not sure, I have to check. <laughs> oh, what are you talking about? That hits him perfectly fine. 
What the hell? I am running into your precious green things. Oh, that was shit. That was shit. <laughs> I am fully aware of that. And I'm quite worried because... Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I'm, fu I'm fully aware that I don't have a spark right now. And he keeps shooting green things at me. No, no, no. Oh, I missed it! I completely headbutted nothing then. Oh! Come on, come on. Come on! What the hell? That hit him perfectly fine. Come on. Yay! I am so great. Hello, Herbie. Nice to meet you. Can I move? No. <laughs> and that was that. Oh, the key! I forgot about the key. We can go get the, um, don't you dare take me back. Why would you do that? We can get a sparks back and there's, oh, there's one over here too. And we can go get this, this, um, the chest. Would you, what the hell is going on? I'm losing my patience very quickly. Very quickly. Oh, oh. Good job that sign stopped me, otherwise I would have been straight in there. Here we go, here's the chest, isn't it? Here you are. Look at the key fly. Boom! There's a 25 gem there. Fair enough. <laughs> I think that you can kind of tell that they tried to make up the gems a bit because that's not the only 25 gem in this world. I think there's one in Sheila's level too. Oh no! Quick! Ah! Oh no! Yay! We didn't get killed! Go forward Spyro! That is the right direction to go! Oh my god, right. Let's go do it. Let's go do uh, Sheila's level. And... Let's get out of here! This might take a while though, I'm pretty sure this. <laughs> this swamp smells so sweet. The springtime trees are fragrant. I'm off to kick butt. <laughs> I'm pretty sure they're all, they are all speaking in haiku. Sheila's main objective in this is to kick and punch things. Face, well, kick and slam things like that. Because we are leading some blind people through a lot of traps. So let's see what they have to say. They'll say it better than me. We have the bombs here. We must destroy the egg cage, but we just go boom. Oh, sorry, I skipped that. Kangaroo can help. You can clear the path for us. Will Sheila help us? Yes, I love your freestyle haiku. Yes, it's bombing time. Here I come, my little eggs, to free you at last. Let's do this. So all we have to do is remove the obstacles out of the way for him. But you can't just go straight ahead and remove all of them because they'll respawn <laughs> after a time. So you have to be very careful. <laughs> Especially the mushrooms, they come back really quick. I don't know which way he's going. He's going this way, cool, right, okay. very the like faint what's the word is it faint just fake it and go the wrong way go on Spyro. where's he gone where's he gone he went the other way Ow! i went to boom again big rocks can be kicked they say mushrooms must be stomped Right, let's do this for real. For real! Yeah, cool, cool, we got that right. Now where are you going? Where are you going? Oh no, oh no! Ah! Oh, oh. Where are you going? Fair enough. Okay, 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 okay. We'll do this for real. 
I don't know why I had to get rid of that one because he doesn't even go there. And he comes to this one, kick that out of the way, and he comes to this mushroom here and just stomp that out of the way. This is just pure trial and error. This is pure trial and error. Alright, and then he comes to this mushroom. Or does he go around it? He goes around it. Then if you would hurry up. And then he goes to this rock. And then he goes to this mushroom. You come in. Then he goes to this rock. And then he goes back to this mushroom. And then I don't know where he goes from here. <laughs> we'll be frank. Get rid of everything as quickly as possible. Oh yay! Yay! Go put that bomb there! Blow it up! Hello Peggy! Oh, cute! I like how when they blink, the glass is blank. One egg cage remains. Will you now help my brother to freeze the last egg? Yeah. Yeah, we'll do this. If you clear my path, I can blow up the egg cage. Poor, poor captive eggs. Yes, it's bombing time. Here I come, my little eggs, to free you at last. Oh, damn it. Oh, you bugger! I'm pretty sure I can't remember. Do ah, no, it's this way! <gasps> no, we went to the wrong one! Bugger! <laughs> right, so you get your bomb. You come this way. And I kick the rocks out. The rocks are really easy to kick out the way, they they're really quick. But it takes a lot longer to get rid of the mushrooms. And this beginning bit is just all rocks. And I kick all the rocks out of the way. And it's all rocks. And then you come around here and it's a mushroom. And I stomp the mushroom. And then it's just rocks again. And we come around and we just kick the rocks. We get rid of the rocks. All the rocks. And then we come back around. And you come around with me. And then we come forward. And you want this mushroom here. And then we kick this rock out of the way. And we get rid of this mushroom here. And then you just put it there. Yay! Okay. Hello, Michelle. Cute. The eggs are all free. Two dragons are born today. Sheila's my hero! Ah, Thank you, Busen. Where, however you pronounce that. Right, so we're gonna get the gems now! We got all the eggs, so we're gonna get the gems! And this level's not too bad, I guess. I know there's one tricky bit where I don't know how to get the gem. <laughs> oh, that's it. That's the tricky bit where I don't know how to get the gem, right there. Um, <laughs> well, we figured that out easily. Because it's like a cage at the beginning, you can just see the 25 gem behind it and sparks can't quite reach it. So what we're going to do is we're just going to head around the outside of all these places. And then we're going to head inside, find any caves, and I think there's some stuff in the, in the ceiling. Yeah. Please! Please! Sheila! Right, and we have two in here, so... I mean, this, this level's very generous with gems. <laughs> And we're supposed to come to get about that bit in the ceiling up there. Yay! Right. Ooh, this bit's nice. It's very uniform, very green. And purple. I'm guessing we're not that far off, uh, gem count wise. <laughs> I'm hoping we're not that far off, gem count wise. I don't know what I'd do if we weren't. And there's another ceiling up there. They're kind of sneaky. But you can see them pretty easily, so it's not that sneaky. Ooh, for a 10 gem. 
I bet we've got like 15 more. Unless we... yeah. I don't know. Is that the gem that we just got? Yeah. There's a couple of wands around the outside. So we go around the other outside now. Did we get... were there any in here? Yeah, there's one in here too. Right, we'll go around the other outside now and see if there are any floating about on the right hand side. Oh, there's a basket over there which I'm gonna get that. Two gems! Okay, okay, I'm starting to worry. missing four. So it's probably two two gems, two green gems somewhere that we're missing. I can assure you they're not in the rocks. The rocks don't have anything in them. Oh, hello! Okay. Yay! Yay! Come on, last one! 500 gems! Woo! We did it! We did it! Let's leave! Level complete! Let's go! Where's the exit? Around the corner? In here we go! Well, what the hell happened there? Long glide out of the level. Next time on Let's Play Spire Year of the Dragon, we'll be going to Bamboo Terrace. And when we finish Bamboo Terrace, we'll go fight the next boss and go to Evening Lake. So I'll see you next time guys, goodbye, oh, yeah, good stretch, good stretch, that was a good stretch.